Das Daddy? scheint nicht so huh? gut zu sein. Ein paar Probleme und so, würde ich mal sagen. Und hier war ein Funkgerät. Sie gehört haben. Wo wir es finden. Ja, das ist. Hallo? You need to be quiet. Okay. I'm not a monster. Good. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Oh, where are you? Boat is? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Das ist äh, schlecht. Ich möchte jetzt aber noch nicht falsch sagen. Na, obwohl es nicht schlecht ist. Ähm, super, super. Oh Gott, nie. Nicht zum zweiten Mal. Das ist intelligent, das ist ja ganz bestimmt nicht. Warum hat Clementine eigentlich so ein... Ja. Sollte außer Gefecht gesetzt sein. Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. Uh, I think so too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. Auf dich schützen. What should we do now? Hoffentlich habe ich verlesen. Ah ja, bevor es dunkel wird. Ja, es ist nicht sicher am Abend. Lass uns gehen. Stay close to me. Ja, einfach aus dem Grund, Tag. Man sieht die Zombies leichter. Nachts kann man einfach entspringen. Zack. Gewiss man, das war's. Man muss sagen, Clementine hat echt Glück, ich meine, er tiebt ja ganz schön verrückte äh, Typ mit der Zombie-Akolypse und ja, dass er einfach mit dem Erstbesten mitgeht, das ist, hat sich Glück gehabt, damit Lynette ist, sag ich mal. Oh, oh, man. I ain't never getting home to Mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot this night. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? 
I won't leave you alone. Sehr gut, Papa, wir lassen sie nicht allein. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna <laughs> hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Um. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be this safe. Is my there. daughter. I'm not a dad. I'm... Um. Babysitter. Her babysitter. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... The monster's coming. We gotta go. Schlecht. Lee, quick. Let's go. Come on, let's get us out of that shit. Now he said it. Stop. As babysitters go, I'd say her parents owe you a tip. Ja, das wäre erstmal ein Kopf, würde ich sagen. Fürs Erste. Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snip. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. So, Sean, you erstmal sicher zu sein. So das aussieht. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Well, Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Yeah. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. Left. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. The greens. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Um, Autounfall. Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed? Before the car accident. Um, aus Atlanta. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl. 
I'm I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. I wouldn't worry too much. We're pretty far from the city. Seems like that's where it's the worst. Yeah. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. We'll try to. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. Oh, da oben sind auch schon ein paar Leute, die auch hier in der Schweine schaffen. It smells like... Mist. <laughs> Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Just like that. I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Well, erst mal schlafen. I love you, baby. Ja, schlecht geträumt würde ich mal sagen. Schätzen. Vermuten. Denken. Was auch immer. Hey, get up. Und ein neuer. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. But I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! <laughs> See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Um, sure, yeah, we'll much. tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. <laughs> I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Hey there, girls. So, uh, 
What do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Well, you should actually handles. look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some just just uh, it's okay it's fine you don't have to say anymore i want to go home tomorrow but even then i can't take away the things we the things doc went through don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this anybody in their right mind would families and barbecues and beers with good friends all of those things those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. So, das war's aber erstmal für ja die erste Aufnahme. Ich werde das Ganze jetzt handeln und hochladen und ja, wir sehen uns dann das nächste Mal. Bis dann und.